The coastline and landscapes of the Isle of Mull have inspired many artists and craftspeople. We're going to journey across the island to take a look at three different art forms in three different locations on Mull. Hi, my name's Andy Fellows. I'm a metal worker, blacksmith, living on the Isle of Mull. Uh, my work is usually gates and railings and repairs for people, but when I can, I like to make ornamental gifts, if you like, ironwork, which are inspired by the landscape and the wildlife around us on Mull. I enjoy work working with uh, metal because it seems such a cold and hard and unworkable material but with a bit of heat and a, and a hammer it can create graceful natural forms that you might see in nature and it's great to be able to make items for people who have got an idea and with the flexibility of heating metal and also being able to weld it and shape it in whichever way I want, I can usually make something that suits their needs and they're something they're happy with. And very often, living where we do, it's inspired by what's around us, you know, wildlife or nature. And I try to incorporate that into, into the, uh, the job. And yeah, I'm just having a great time doing it, you know. I'm Graham Bruce Richards and I'm Sally Bruce Richards and we're both artists that live on the Isle of Mull. Uh, we both, both work as um, individual artists and we paint uh, in our own unique styles but we also uniquely we paint collaboratively um, on location and um, try and approach it with a sense of uh, discovery so it's kind of like f for the first time. Uh, so we, the, the approach would be I would do the initial um, working out of the background of the painting and, and then I'd hand it over to Sally who would do her part which would normally be the maybe for example the, the grass is in the foreground or something that would allow you to sort of look past her work and into mine so you get the juxtaposition of both uh, both works against each other. Um, Sometimes when we're working outdoors, um, people might come up to us and, and chat to us and, and share with, with us their, their stories of, of Mull and um, maybe the love of the particular location we're painting, which really adds to the experience of working outdoors. Hi, I'm um, Fee. I'm from uh, Mull Willow. We're um, a small willow croft, we're small scale growers and we, um, we try to work with nature so we don't use any um, artificial fertilisers or um, any pesticides. So the willow is growing on our land outside um, and we form willow beds because it grows better if you grow it in, in blocks of different varieties of willow. After a season, so probably until the end of March we've got um, to harvest the willow. Um, cut it, bundle it um, into big bundles, size it, grade it so that we have willow in working bundles ready to make things with. We're trying to develop our courses a little bit more and we have um, a great basket maker working with us, Mally, um, who's very experienced and very knowledgeable and is taking us forward look, making lots of wonderful things. So this year we're going to offer a, a range of courses. Um, a half day course for people so that they, they get chance to experience those skills even though they might not have lots of time on holiday. Um, a day course and a, a two day course for those people who have you know, got a bit more time and um, are really very interested in the craft. 